Hello, everybody. This is uh, the Bro and Sis for another installment of another beer review. Uh, as you can see, she's wearing orange, and we have our pumpkin. So this means we're going to be taste testing a pumpkin seasonal ale. Uh, it is brewed by Scherf Brewing Company in Salt Lake City, Utah. It's a Wasatch beer. Um, Wasatch? Yeah, I'm going to say Wasatch. What if it's Wasatch? Well, that's Wasatch. But anyway, it's a pretty good company. Uh, in 2010, uh, the Utah Brewers, <clears throat> uh, Wasatch and Squires Brewing, uh, won national awards in, uh, for the best brewing company of the year at the Great American Beer Brew Festival. So it's a good quality beer. International Brew Festival? It's a brew beer. You said brew festival. By the way, look at the tan. That was fun. Anyway. 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 Yeah, okay. Um, so anyways, so I think you want to go grab the beer and we'll uh, pop it off. Taste test. It's a cool looking label. Why don't you read us on the back what it says? Pumpkin seasonal ale brewed with natural pumpkin and spices. Brewed with the finest barley and pure pumpkin, then spiced like your favorite holiday pie. This amber hued ale is sure to please. All right, well, let's see. Show them, show them, the, uh, show them the top, show them the top. Alcohol 4.0%. Let's do this. Let's see if it has any smoke. Nothing. All right, so what colors do we see here? You tell me. I'm going to say, ooh, almost like the pumpkin. Not really. Um, hmm, kind of has the color of urine again. A leaky. <laughs> okay, maybe not. It's a slight haze, amber color. It's not super, super amber. clear. There we go, amber. Um, very, very little head. Ooh, I can smell the pumpkin. Oh, yeah, yeah, I smell spices, smell pumpkin for sure. Lots of lots of malt. It kind of smells like Christmas a little bit. No hoppy scents whatsoever. Oh, go. I smell, uh, what's that? Cloves? No, what do we put in the, um... Cloves. Cloves? Probably. That we boil to make the house smell good? No, the, the cinnamon sticks. Uh, yeah. Let's try it. I'm going right, to try cheers. it. Cheers. Oh, wow. Interesting. Kind of tastes like. Uh, I do taste spice in it though. Yeah, spice, a lot of spice. I do taste a lot of spice. Man, it smells good though. I like it. Look at that lacing. I like no. it too. Did it's we refreshing. say that there's no head? Yeah, we said there's no head. Like I said, hazy. Yeah. Just a little bit of bubbles, a little bit of sizzle. Wow. Yeah, if you were if you were to make like it, it if you were to make a pumpkin pie, you know, before you throw it in the oven, it's just the, that liquid that you throw in the uh, in the pie crust and you're about to throw it in the oven and you stick your head in there and you smell all those spices and the eggs and the pumpkin. And that's the exactly evaporated what it smells milk, like. You know? That's what it is, you know? It's beautiful. Very malty. It's a very nice, sweet beer. It goes down. Smooth. There is a lot Not of carbonation. Quick. There is carbonation, yeah. Good amount of carbonation there. So, uh, is this something you would recommend? I think so. For this season, yes. For, for <clears throat> October, November, definitely. Um, yeah, me too. I wouldn't eat it with like steaks or anything like that. You know, something light, maybe like a nice little... Pumpkin pie! <clears throat> 
who drinks beer with pumpkin pie? But I guess <laughs> we could. Real, real beer advocates do. So, um, so it, it's it's a winner. I like it a lot, it's and I'm glad I bought a six pack. Uh oh. Uh, that was gross. Say excuse. Excuse me. It's about eight dollars and forty nine cents for a six pack here at Specs. That's terrible. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys.